Welcome to Enchanted Tarot. Before I begin, I would like to say thank you to everyone who has liked, shared, subscribed, and donated to my channel. Also, thank you to everyone who has commented on my videos. Now, um, do keep in mind that these are general readings, so they're not going to resonate with everybody, and especially not, uh, you know, all the time. Um, so, if this resonates with you, the message is for you. If it does not resonate with you, then it is not for you. It's that simple. Um, this really, I feel, is for somebody specific. Um, whoever you are, <laughs> I feel that you're dealing with two people, um, a choice to make. Um, <clears throat> this is for, by the way, before I forget, this is for the sign of Aquarius for the month of January, and this is a love reading. Um, let's begin. We have the Ace of Pentacles here. This is an opportunity for a new beginning, okay? Something very solid. Uh, this can also indicate a home move. Let's look deeper. All right. I feel that in the past, there was a breakup and you probably have not had any communication from that person for a while. I feel that there are a lot of regrets because you felt that this person uh, was your happily ever after, okay? Um, it's possible there was a third party influence back then, um, but this is somebody, like, you know, that could have be what broke this up, I don't know. Um, I'm simply telling you what I see here, okay? Um, it could have been somebody that perhaps was difficult to deal with. Um, but this is somebody you, um, you were looking at a long-term, solid relationship with this person. And I feel that you're still healing from this. And I feel that you are waiting on news from this person. I feel that you may feel that you have done all that you could, okay? Um, and now it's like you're waiting and waiting and you've had no news. Now, I feel that you are presently with somebody else. I feel that you kind of gave up on that person. Okay, um, it's here in the seven of coins reverse. That's like somebody, who, you know, they cut their losses and they leave. They're tired of waiting. They've lost patience. And so the intention is to leave the past behind. Um, and they may have rushed into another relationship here. Um, I'll mention the sign, but it doesn't have to necessarily be that sign, okay? But you may have rushed into a relationship with a, um, a fire sign. <clears throat> I feel that it's okay, you're happy, but you're missing uh, you're missing, uh, let's put it this way, you're missing the tenth cup for your happily ever after. But you're happy, you're okay with this person. Uh, but he's not your, he's not like the one, okay? He's not the one that has your heart. Or she, I say he, but I mean it could be she. Um, I feel that um, it like, you know, here I had a fire sign and here I have an earth sign. Um, you could be with somebody who is, um, you know, a good worker, uh, very stable, but they don't, 
they don't, like they can't give you that Ten of Cups feeling, you know? It's missing. There's something missing. And in that sense, um, you could be feeling discouraged. You are definitely waiting on somebody from your past because it's here. It flew out of the deck. It's possible that you will have news from this person or bump into them or have a reunion, a meeting, very possible with that card. Here again, we see we have the Page of Cups with the world in reverse and the Two of Cups in the after tarot. It's like um, two soulmates coming together, okay? And so the world reversed is, um, it's like unfinished business that needs to be taken care of. And this is what you're waiting on you're waiting to hear news from this person from your past who you feel is your soulmate and very likely is a soulmate. I feel that you are still in that period of recovery. Um, thinking, doing a lot of thinking. I have the Ace of Swords here, which, um, and the Seven of Cups in reverse, which is uh, clarity uh, along with this Ace of Swords. So I feel that you uh, are going to gain clarity because you see here somebody's coming to bring you uh, a flower there and for me it's like an offer of peace you could be reflecting upon this you may want this offer of peace um, or you want to put things to rest you want to clear things up you could have taken the decision to try to heal here. But I feel it's not working <laughs> very well because I feel that um, you're still waiting. You could be reflecting here upon a truth that came out in the past, the reason why you're no longer together But still, this is what you yearn for here, is this person, okay? Um, so you are like in this, um, you, you want to get back on your feet, okay? You've been trying, you started up another relationship, um, you know, hoping perhaps, I, I don't know, perhaps this person will help you forget the other. I don't know what your reasons were. Or perhaps you just didn't want to be alone. But you can't forget this person. Why? You have a soulmate connection with that person. That, you know, and, and this is why you can't release. Um, you feel like this person left you hanging, you know? And um, you have a, you know, a lot of anxieties with regards to this. Queen of Wands, Four of Cups, 
the Hierophant, and death. So this queen, who is usually uh, quite able to heal herself, you know, she can heal any area of her life, this queen. She's not happy with her present situation with the other person, okay? So she's still caught up in the past. That's where her heart is. This person that she is separated from and um, has been having a very difficult time uh, making the transition here in dealing with this separation. I feel that um, the relationship you're presently in is a short-term relationship. Um, I feel that you're thinking about deciding or it's like trying to decide uh, whether you want a future with this person or not. Um, You could be feeling kind of stuck. E, and you know, like, I, it's, it's funny, but I feel whoever this is for, you're in a relationship, and you know, it's, it's okay, but you're obsessing here about somebody else. Somebody else um, you want a second chance with this person. Yeah, I, the, um, the devil energy is carried over here uh, along with the knight of wands in reverse and the three of coins. So what I'm getting is that uh, although you are in a relationship here, you are obsessing about another and trying to make a decision about this one that you're presently in. I feel that um, that you will end this or they will end this that because I have somebody here alone and it's possible that they may have an interest in somebody else okay um, but you know uh, so do you in a in a way <laughs> you are thinking about somebody from the past so yeah um, And so we have the magician next to the devil. This is an illusion, okay? So, and, and you know, um, and, and I feel that this is this present relationship. Um, it's like everybody plays their part, but I mean, it's, it's not really going anywhere. And you're not talking or taking action. Um, And, and what I heard was, neither are they. So it's like you're, it's like a, and you know, you could be lying to yourself here. And so we finish this reading with um, you holding on, and, and I feel like you're holding on to the memory of this person. Uh, the present relationship is moving into the past. Um, and, and you know, and I, and I don't think that you're sad about that because you're still wanting this one here. 
and um, it is very possible that you will get news from that person. Uh, this could come by uh, any means. Um, it could come by the internet. It could be uh, a letter, a text. So now <clears throat> we have the five of coins feeling left out in the cold uh, and reflecting uh, once again upon the past here and turning down this new offer is what I get from this card because you're still um, tied to this person in the past. And so that is what I have for you, Aquarius. I do hope that this helps somebody out there. And um, I thank you so much for watching my channel. If you would like to purchase uh, a private reading, the details on how to do so are in the description box below. Many blessings to you. Bye for now.